A lot of users are having issues with vibration on their Galaxy S25 Ultra. So it's either not vibrating at all or the vibration is really weak. Whether incoming calls, notification, when it's connected to charger, if you're having the no vibration issue, let's go ahead and fix it. All right, so first we're gonna just open up settings on our device. Scroll down for sounds and vibration. If you're not getting vibration while ringing, simply turn this vibration while ringing option on. After that, enter notification sound to notification vibration. Now first from here, it can change or increase the vibration intensity in case your vibration is weak. After that, check out all these vibration patterns one after another and uh, make sure to select the one that's more recognizable. Going back two steps to sounds and vibration settings, scroll down for call vibration and do the exact same that we've already shown you. Now going back one step to system vibration now and uh, apart from changing the intensity, you can change the vibration feedback for all these different functions and options. And lastly, in vibration intensity, you can increase or decrease the overall vibration intensity for different functions. And also, you can enable this additional vibration sound option for incoming calls. Now, even after that, if a specific app fails to give you a notification with vibration, open up settings from there to apps. Search for that specific app to notification, make sure it's allowed, and also make sure sound and vibration option is turned on. And after changing all these settings, it's recommended that you can just go ahead and restart your device once. If vibration is still not working properly on your device, there might be some customized settings that's causing all this issue. So now we're gonna just reset all settings on our device. From settings, Scroll down for general management to reset, to reset all settings. This will not delete any data, but make sure you have your Wi-Fi password. That's all. Just tap on reset settings a couple of times. And after reset all settings, your device will restart and hopefully your problem will be solved. Now, just in case, if you're still having this problem every once in a while, you can test your vibration from device care. Just make sure you are logged in with your Samsung account for that. So from settings, go to device care, scroll down for diagnostics to phone diagnostics. And from this list, find out vibration, tap on it and test the vibration function by tapping on this button. If you can feel the vibration, press yes, otherwise press no. Test your notification vibration. And according to your diagnostic experience, you can either test again or as prompted, take this device to Samsung support. And that's all for this video. Thanks for watching.